Hi YouTube, this is Tara and welcome back to my channel. Okay, so I made it home. I was trying to do a video while I was at the public transit station so that, um, oh, you know what? I had to say that was the broom, that's the mop. Um, the public transit station so y'all can see my look and natural light. This is what it looks like in my daughter house. Her lights are kind of yellow. Uh, I'm looking at myself in the mirror and not bad. Because at first I thought it was a little bit too ashy. I think the ash is coming off from here. Where like if you got high pigmentation. And you put um, your foundations and products on. That discoloration is um, not going to show right. But yeah, just what it looks like. This is the Sephora Battle Skin Foundation. This is the Crayon Case um, Liquid Matte in shade Fern. F-E-R-N. This is a Sephora 39 piece um, set. It has eyeshadows and lip glosses. Face face, and lip set. I think it's called. Got highlighters and all that kind of stuff on it. Okay. So this is what it looks like. And it looked pretty decent. Look pretty decent. Now when I move the phone back, it looked like it's kind of lighter. Like then my chest. But when I bring it in, everything looked kind of uniform. So let's take it outside. Okay, so I'm outside and the sun is kind of going down a little bit. And uh, this is what it looks like when I'm outside in natural light. So, I mean, it doesn't look bad. It doesn't look bad at all. So, yeah, Peter asked me, he said, Well, you went to the mall? I said, No. He said, Who did makeup for you? I said, Oh, I did it. He said, Oh, okay, excuse me. Excuse me, <laughs> you know, I know he's being funny. Maybe not, because you gotta know Peter. Okay, and um, I told him, I said, yeah, I got so much of it, I don't use it, probably gonna end up throwing it away. Yeah, so, yeah, so that's it. You know, that's what it looks like. And the light, I'm gonna try to bake me some chicken. I'm kind of hungry and that's a good thing y'all because um in one of my other videos I was talking about how I eat because I know it's time like breakfast lunch and dinner whether I'm hungry or not because I don't want to wait till later and then try to eat and then I don't have an opportunity to chance like at work if I don't eat breakfast I can't eat nothing until lunch and just not get a snack and then if I don't eat lunch I can't eat nothing later unless I get a snack and then come home and eat dinner. If I'm not in overtime. So yeah, I was in overtime today. The guy stayed. Look. I don't like that. Where that come from? The nutty professor? Hercules. Hercules. Sherman, Sherman, Sherman. Uh-uh. Anyway. So, yeah, they let me work overtime. So, I stayed to 5.30 because normally I get up at 4.30. So, I stayed an hour over. And um, then I got out, you know, because the supervisor who's there, you know, he be like, let's go, let's go, let's go. Because it's not my supervisor. And it's kind of unfair because my supervisor leave at 10 something. She get there, she get there at 6 and she leave at 2 something, 2.30. And you know you got staff there. That needs to work overtime. You mandatory it. It's your mandatory overtime. <laughs> but it also helped my numbers because the less hours you have, it's like the numbers are uh, there's less accounts. They have to divide the numbers up for you to make your productivity. So like today I did 90 accounts and I worked eight hours. And I think eight hours and 30 minutes, I think. But even if I worked nine hours, divide that by 90, that's 10. That means on average, you did 10 accounts an hour. So, and yesterday I did 80 accounts. And I did 80 hours and 30 minutes. So, of course, they're going to take uh, out 45 minutes out for lunch and a two 15-minute break. So, when they divide that by eight, it's going to be still 10 accounts an hour. So, yeah. So that's how they do it. Uh, so yeah, you know what it looked like. So 
it, it looks decent. In fact, I, I'm thinking about if y'all see that number, don't. I'm thinking about um. Oh, sh I'm thinking about just you know wearing it because it's pretty. It looks like it just looks like my skin, you know. And look, I guess because it's a little cool today, I don't see no sweating. Cause y'all know I don't have oils unless it's here. In here, there's no oils there. There's no oils here, and there's no sweating. You see that? Like a little natural shine, a natural shine to the skin. Yeah. So yeah, thanks for watching. Don't don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, thumbs up my video. Tell a friend, tell a friend about my channel. I love you for watching to the end. Now, the reason why I do these videos is so that I can do like a real true wear test to show y'all, okay, well, I've been in this makeup for at least a good six hours. And um, I've come home in, in the elements because it's a little cool today. So I may try the foundation again tomorrow. And I didn't bring it home. I didn't bring it home. So you know what? I don't even think I better try tomorrow because we having a social. It's a Brockworth social. A Brocksworth social. So yeah, it's a Brocksworth social. So yeah. I think we're gonna have slow and stuff. There's some slow in the refrigerator near. So I think I'm gonna take some with me just in case. These Negroes don't have no slow, but I think they're gonna have slow. Yeah, my doctor was talking about he wanted to check my thyroid. What is that? Mm-mm. Bye! That's a note. They've been there for months. I think these people skipped out on their rent. Yeah. I would get in and read it, but I ain't. Because another, it's another one upstairs where I... <laughs> It's a note in their door. And I think they skipped out on their rent. In fact, there's some groceries was sitting in front of the door. I guess they forgot they moved it, illegally all of a sudden. So it was some note, groceries sitting up there in the door, in front of the door. So from Publix, Instacart. <laughs> I guess they say, dang. It's not making any noise. It's not Look, I got a cliff like Michael Jackson. Y'all know I'm gonna get rid of this fat. Bye. Bye.